Biomes of the World by Emma and Yanni. The tropical rainforest is one biome that makes up almost half of the world, but now only about 3% remain. Many of our animals and plants live there. They are known as biotic factors. All of the rainforests in the world are located along the equator. Since the equator is warm, that is how and why the tropical rainforests are located there. Rainforests have four layers. The first layer is the emergent layer. Giant trees grow above the dense canopy layer and have mushroom-shaped tops. The second layer is the canopy layer. The broad tops of the trees create a continuous canopy 60 to 90 feet above the ground. The canopy is home to 90% of the organisms in the rainforest. The third layer is the, of the rainforest is the understory. Receiving less than 15% of the light from the canopy, the understory contains young trees and leafy plants that tolerate low light. The last layer is the forest floor. This layer receives the least light, less than 2%. On the forest floor are fallen leaves, seeds, fruits, and branches that quickly decompose. The animals in the rainforest are known as biotic factors. The golden lion tamaranian is one of the most endangered species in the world. It is one of the rarest colored mammals in the rainforest. The fur is known as strawberry blonde. The African forest elephant is a huge animal and stands around 12 feet tall. It has large ears that come to a point at the bottom. Its tusks are long and curved to help eat prey. The chimpanzee, which is also known as a chimp, weighs from 99 to 176 pounds. Its favorite foods are fruits and young leaves. They also live close to the canopy in the rainforest. The toko toucan is one of the largest toucans in the whole world. It weighs around 10 to 17 ounces and has a massive bill, but it is not as heavy as it seems. It also nests in the holes of trees which are found deep in the rainforest. The Bengal tiger is known as one of the most beautiful animals known to live in the rainforest. It can weigh up to 575 pounds and is very sneaky. It is a carnivore that feasts on boars, wild oxen, monkeys, and other animals. Biotic factors are also known as plants. The jambu is a very small but crisp fruit. It grows from southern India to eastern Malia. It is also a member of the myrtle family and is a small tree or shrub that grows to about 10 to 20 feet. Finally, they have open crowns as their buds. Strangler figs are one of the most important plant species in the rainforest environment. Pigeons, parrots, hornbills, toucans, monkeys, gibbons, and fruiting bats feed on the fig fruit. 70% of the rainforest herbivores rely on the fig tree for food. Mangroves are woody trees. They are the only plant in the rainforest that can live where the rainforests meet ocean water. Mangroves are found on sheltered coastlines and river deltas and can grow on the wetland between land and sea. Mangrove trees protect the coastlines and prevent erosion. The Bengal bamboo is found in every rainforest in the world. It does very well in moist environments with plenty of rainfall. This bamboo can grow anywhere from 40 to 80 feet. The leaves are long and narrow and are very green in color. Believe it or not, this bamboo is not a tree or shrub. It is grass. The coir plant grows to be very large like a vine and is found in the canopy of rainforests. Their vine may get as big as four inches thick. Also, the leaves are formed in the shape of a heart. The leaves are very smooth on top, but the bottom is white and hairy. Many people in foreign countries use these plants for cooking. They use the roots and stems for their meals. Abiotic factors are non-living things. Here are some of the abiotic factors we found in the rainforest. Some things that we found interesting were that more than half of the world's estimated 10 million species of plants and animals live in the tropical rainforest. Another thing that we found interesting was that 80% of the developed world's diet originated in the tropical rainforests.